Hey guys, it's Sydney, the Crab Queen. Baby, I'm a witch and I'll never let you know. I can make shit happen, you ain't never seen before. Psychic all the time, I know how this is about to go. So in today's video, we're going to be doing a why are you hot based on your zodiac sign. So I haven't really done any videos like this before. I'm not even sure if I've done any videos like talking about zodiac signs in general. But I figured this would be a fun little video and... Um, obviously go watch your sun sign, you know, your main sign, your zodiac sign, but then you have a sun, moon, and rising sign, so I feel like the moon and rising sign would also help and it would be fun to watch too because then you can figure out why you are, as a whole, as a complete, as a human being, are hot all of those characteristic traits put together. It would make a lot more sense if all three were involved. And if you don't know your sun, moon, or rising, or if you don't know your moon and rising sign, you can go to Google, go to Safari, and look up natal chart. And then you can put in all your information and then voila, you figured it out. Make sure you read all of your natal chart information too when it shows up because it'll make a lot of sense for you. So I'm going to put the time links below so you can skip over to uh, your part of the video. And if you wanted to watch all of it, cool. But if you just want to watch yours, the links are down below. And then we're also going to start with Aries because in astrology, in the zodiac world, uh, we always start in April, which is Aries. That's the new beginning, the new year for astrology is in April. So we're going to start with Aries because that's their birth month. So let's just hop right in to the video and find out why you are hot. All right, Aries. So first of all, you are a fire sign. Same with Leo and Sagittarius. So those are your best accompanying acquaintances. So let's find out where your hot Aries. So first of all, I just want to let you guys know that you Aries are the lucky ones. You are the number one zodiac sign that is the hottest based on appearance just in all. You guys are the hottest zodiac sign according to whoever, whoever came up with that theory. So that's cool for you. You guys are baddies, you know, you have this childish energy which makes you fun to want to be around. You know, it makes people want to like come to you and be around you when they're trying to have a fun time, when they're just trying to have their inner child be released and that's a good feeling. So it draws people in towards you because they want that feeling. All right, so you guys are childlike energies. You know, you just have that kid energy going on and people always want to be around that. You guys are so passionate, okay? so. Whatever you find love in, whatever you find interested in, you know, you put passion into it. Even if it's a human being, you put passion into it. You are so passionate. You do everything with passion and that's what really captures other people's attention about you, Aries, is the passion that you have in everything. So, like people rule with their emotions, you kind of rule with the passion, so whatever you feel very like you should be doing you really go towards it and you really do it so a lot of people are closed off and they don't like to talk about how they feel but you aries you have no problem with it you like to tell everyone how you feel you know if you're sad you'll just be like i'm sad or like if you're happy you're gonna be like i'm so happy today and you really make it like known to everyone and that really inspires people how you like to let everyone know how you're feeling because a lot of people are scared to do that and they don't want to do that so it really inspires people and captures people's attention when you do that. You're almost like irresistible when you do that. Actually, when you tell people how you feel, that really inspires people to want to do the same. And then, of course, confidence is another big one. You know, you guys are naturally a little bit more confident than other people's. And of course, that is the number one turn on for people is confidence. Confidence is key. We all know that. So yeah, confidence is another big one for you, Aries. And like I said, you guys are the number one most naturally attractive zodiac sign. So that's just a little information. I'll skip to your rest of your natal chart to watch the rest and find out how you are more attractive. So that was it for you, Aries. Bye, and I love you. Hello, Tauruses. All right, so you guys are an earth sign along with Capricorn and Virgos. So that's who you would, 
you know, kind of get along best with, the people that are most similar to you, earth sign traits, earth sign qualities, you know. So what is really attractive about you, Taurus, is you guys are really good at being human. You know, a lot of people find it hard to be human and struggle with it, but Tauruses, you're really good at being human. You come to terms with being human. That's your first priority is doing human stuff, okay? What I mean by that is you know when it's time to get up and go to work you know when it's time to get up and go to school you know when it you know it's time when you have to deal with your emotions you know when it's time to have to deal with your anger or when it when someone is sad around you you don't get really annoyed by that you know because you get you get being human you get that it's a thing when shitty things happen in life you come to terms with it you're like okay well shitty things happen and that all makes you a really comforting person, a really comforting friend, and that's why people are really drawn to you. You're really good at helping others out. It's just a natural thing that you do, you know, you really like to help others, help people with maybe like physical things, maybe with money, like, or maybe with just if they don't have enough clothes, you know, you give them a shirt, just stuff like that. Maybe even with their emotions, I know that Tauruses aren't a water sign, but they still do have emotions and still are very kind to people who are dealing with their emotions. So you guys are really good at helping people out, which makes other people drawn towards you. And then what really makes you hot is that your planet is Venus. And that is the planet of love, making love, you know, all that type of stuff, passion. So naturally, you guys are just really good at being lovers and you guys are really like naturally attractive because of your planet is in venus so i feel like that definitely helps a lot and then also if you guys didn't know this you guys are supposedly i don't know you guys are really good in bed because of your planet sign at venus and then of course you guys already know this but you are very trustworthy and um loyal so obviously that really makes people attracted to you, really want to be around you because they can pick up on the vibes that you're a loyal person, that you're a loyal friend or a loyal like person to have around in their life. And loyalty is honestly very attractive sometimes when people pick up on that. So that is what makes you attractive. Also when people can rely on you to get shit done, to count on you to come to something on time. I feel like even though you are very slow, you're still very reliable. And I feel like people can count on you uh, if you give them your word to do something, you'll do it. And people really find that attractive about you, Taurus. All right, so go watch the rest of your natal chart to find out more about yourself. But that is it for you, Taurus. So yeah. Bye, and I love you. Hi, Geminis. So you guys are an air sign along with Aquarius and Libra. So those are your, you know, potential besties, people that are most like you. All right, Gemini. So let's find out why you are attractive based on your zodiac sign. So first of all, you guys are always helping people out. It's kind of more like you guys are helping people avoid bad situations. You know, when you're having a conversation with someone and you pick up uh that you know that probably wouldn't work out best for them or you know uh probably don't make that decision because that will lead you to something bad i have a better route for you you know you kind of help people like with personal things which you think would be best for them and that's why people think that you're attractive because you're always helping people out come up with the best solutions for them and people really like that about you okay also, Gemini is just very flirty and fun and knows how to hold a conversation and a lot of people find that very attractive when they know how to hold a conversation and then also, obviously, you guys are very good at flirting. Sometimes you don't even realize that you're flirting, it's just who you are. You're very good at being flirty, you know what I mean? So Geminis always show up at the right time in your life. That's what Geminis are for, that's why they're put here on Earth to show up in the right times of your life when they're, you're, the Gemini is most needed because like I said, Geminis always help you come up with good solutions for your problems, okay? So they show up when you need those good solutions, all right? So maybe some of you didn't know that, but a lot of people can actually find that very attractive and want to keep Gemini around because they know that they just help them. They're always guiding them and showing up in the right times and it, it really subconsciously like keeps a person around 
when you're doing that for them and it makes you more attractive to them. Of course, Gemini, you're sarcastic, you're funny, you're quick. Those are all traits people find attractive about you. So you guys are super adaptable and you know, you could really go to someone's house for the first time and already feel comfortable because you guys are so adaptable. People find that really amusing about you. Um, also with the adaptable thing, when you're hanging out with a person or whatever, you know, you're just with a person, um, you kind of mirror them. You start to mirror their image. You start to mirror how they're talking. You just pick up on their vibes. So that subconsciously makes that person more attracted to you and finds you attractive and hot because they don't really notice, but you are doing exactly what they do, which obviously they like that. So when you mirror that person or whatever, that makes you very attractive in their eyes. All right, Gemini, so that was for you. Let's give and watch the rest of your natal chart to find out why you are even more attractive. Thank you for watching, Gemini's. Love you. Hello, Cancers. All right, so you guys are a water sign along with Pisces and Scorpio, so you guys would get along best with them. They kind of have the same characteristic traits as you guys. So let's get into why you are attractive based on your zodiac sign. So Cancers naturally have divine feminine energy. You kind of have more female vibes to you. Feminine in them, no matter what gender they are, it's always inside of you. And it brings out everyone's uh, feminine side in them and it really draws them into cancer. You guys have a very warm and inviting energy, obviously. Um, you guys are very kind people and it makes people really want to be around you and that's like the number one most hot, attractive thing for cancers is their just magnetic energy that just draws people in. People just kind of gravitate towards cancers. I just really like to bring out like a soft side in people, you know, they kind of start talking about like their emotions with people or like if something's bothering the person at home or whatever, cancers kind of bring out that side in people which makes people like find them really attractive and it makes them like more connected to them on a deeper level which deeper level always leads to an outer attraction. So that is why people really find you hot. Like I said, you are very caring and very nice and people love nice and caring people. Of course, that is a big one for you, Cancer. And then also, you know, since your planet is the moon, the moon does hold a lot of secrets and unknown energies and people also find it very hot and irresistible. You are not always an open book. You're kind of closed off and people find that very irresistible and attractive that you kind of are the secretive person that no one really knows. All right, Cancer, so skip to the rest of your natal chart to find out why you are hot and attractive based on the rest of your natal chart, all right? So love my Cancers. Talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hello, Leos. Let's find out why you are hot and attractive based on your zodiac sign. And I already know my Leos saw this video and clicked on it right away because they always want to know more ways that they're hot you know what i mean leos are a fire sign so your other fire sign friends are sagittarius and aries so you would find your most similar traits to yourself in them something that makes leo very hot and attractive is that they are super duper passionate they have passion in everything they do if they find a hobby they like they're gonna put all of their passion into it if they go to the grocery store, they're gonna put a lot of passion into going to the grocery store. If they're gonna make a drawing, they're gonna put a lot of passion into it. They don't just do random things for no reason. They love to like make something boring and turn it into something very fun and put a lot of passion into it because they're just naturally passionate people. And their naturally passionate makes them very good lovers um, for people. So obviously that draws people in with all of your passion and your power that you give off. Obviously it's an adventure wherever Leo goes and that catches everyone's eye. A lot of people find that very attractive for the Leo to do that. Also, most of the time Leos know that they're hot and that is something that makes other people think that they're very hot and attractive because of course confidence is key and we love a confident person especially a confident leo leos are usually not typically shy people they like to show off and they like to talk almost kind of brag and i feel like that draws everyone in no matter what whether they're a hater whether whether they fall in love with you 
whichever one people are so very attracted to you and think that you're hot so mostly everyone just loves you is that what you want to hear leo but leo is of course very kind you know there's not very mean leos out there they're always willing to help people and guide people and be super nice to people they're always willing to listen to their friends and family and lovers problems or just whoever's problems they're willing to find solutions for things they're very kind to people and that's also something that people find very attractive about you leo so leo skip to the rest of your needle try to find out why you are even more attractive all of your attractiveness all put together in one so find those links below talk to you guys soon Hi. Hi Virgos. So let's find out why you are hot and attractive based on your zodiac sign. Alright, so first of all, you guys are earth signs. So your other earth sign friends would be Capricorn and Taurus. So those are the people you are going to find some of your characteristic traits in them. They are going to be the most similar to you, Virgo. Alright, so let's find out what makes you attractive. So obviously, Virgo, you're very straight up. You're straightforward. You get to the point. You're very honest. And that captures people's attention like no other because a lot of people don't have the guts to do that. They aren't very straight up. You know, they kind of hide um, how people make them feel or, you know, just stuff like that. Because they're super straight up. So if something's bothering you about someone or something, you know, you guys are going to tell them right away. And that really draws people in because that is a characteristic trait a lot of people wish that they had and you virgo have you guys are very clean people most of the time virgos are very clean people and that's just a trait a lot of people find very attractive so that makes you guys very hot you put yourself before others and i mean that by if you have some plans for yourself or you know something doesn't really benefit you in a way you're really good at saying no and putting yourself first and making yourself your number one priority and people love to see that people love a good confident prioritized person that likes to put themselves first and stay organized so you guys are just very like good at people um your work ethic is really strong people just find you very intimidating you're very independent you don't really need another person obviously we all want another person uh sometimes but you guys really don't need another person and you might even know that um because your your independence is so strong and like i said you're very good at putting yourself first and always getting yourself prioritized so uh, a lot of the times Virgos don't really need another person and you're really good at having boundaries a lot of the times people see a lot of people breaking their boundaries so they can get to them easier you know they find them more easier but Virgo you're not easy it's kind of hard to get to you people find that super attractive about you Virgo you're very intimidating you're very straight up um, and so those are like the main things why you are attractive well, let's get forward to find the rest of your natal chart so finds out why you are attractive um even more attractive to some people so find out that virgo down below and that is why you are attractive all right love you virgos bye hello my libras all right so libra you are an air sign along with gemini and aquarius so you would find a lot of yourself in them so it make them good friends good companions all right so libra you're very peaceful you know you're the peacemaker you like to keep the peace you like to have things be going good especially when it comes to your friends and family you like to keep the peace between people you don't really like when people are arguing and you have a very soft spot and a lot of people find that very attractive obviously a lot of people are attracted to kind people and nice people and that is something that people are very attracted to you about they can see that you're very kind and nice you do put others sometimes even before yourself and that what that is why some people really like you because they see how kind you are and caring and how much you don't want to lose like people you love I'm not saying that libras don't fight because i personally seen libras do kind of argue get into arguments because you know they're an air sign and they they get into debates a lot that's just what air signs do but if it comes down to um, other people, they see other people fighting that they care about, they don't really like to see that. Or if they are in an argument with somebody that they um, really love and don't want to lose, they'll like lose the fight just because they don't want to like lose the friends or the person. So a lot of people find that very attractive about you, Libra. So uh, your guys' planet is Venus and Venus is the planet of love and making love. So naturally, you guys are very 
lovey people people will just find you very attractive naturally for some reason people are just drawn to your loving energy because of your planet is venus so you guys are very lucky to have that so people just find you naturally attractive so many libras are flirty they're so good at flirting their flirting game is strong you know libras are always very attractive people they know how to clean up nice and be cute you know they're very fun and bubbly and happy and they like to have a good time and a lot of people are attracted to that a lot a lot of the times libras also know how to hold conversations and they kind of like go out of their way to have conversations with people and people also find that very attractive because a lot of the times people are shy and don't do that so people are very attracted to that libra all right so you guys are super fun flirty and cute and your planet is venus so you know what that means so libra go skip to the other sections of the video to find the rest of your charts and to find out more things on why you are attractive all right so i will talk to you guys soon and i love you libra hi scorpio okay so i literally have no idea how this happened but i missed your guys's zodiac sign and you guys are like one of my favorite zodiac signs i have no idea how i skipped it but i was editing the video and i was like where the fuck is scorpio so here i am you know it's no big deal for you because you're still here seeing it on time or whatever I look a little crusty, old makeup on from the day before, but that's okay, Scorpio. Alright, let's just, let's find out why you are hot and attractive based on your zodiac sign. Okay, so Scorpio, you guys are a water sign along with Cancer and Pisces. So you would find a lot of your own quality traits in them and you would find a lot of similarities in them, all right? So Scorpio, you guys are a very sexy, mysterious sign. Everyone knows that you guys are actually proven the most sexiest sign that there is. All right, Scorpio, so I bet that's good news to hear. So whether you want a person if you're meeting someone for the first time and you're just figuring them out or if you want a fling or if you want something a deep connection with someone uh you know what to say to keep them hooked to keep them around until you decide until you make up your mind because scorpios have a really good way of keeping people attached and drawing people in scorpios are just um people always want to figure out scorpios you know they're kind of like they have like kind of a sneakier vibe to them they're kind of sassy you know a lot of people find that very attractive and hot so it draws people in and a lot of people want to be around scorpio scorpios are a lot of the time very good looking just naturally scorpio is one of the main signs of love so scorpios are very good at loving and making love if you know what i mean scorpio is very sexy and intriguing kind of draws people in just wherever you go and i feel like scorpios are very into themselves feeling themselves a lot of the time so when they go out that's like a very big thing for people they really like to see it they like to see that uh scorpio is into themselves and feeling themselves and it really draws people in a lot of the times the clothes you wear draw people in really yours is a lot about appearance because i feel like scorpio has a way of getting people in drawn into them by their appearance but also their personality because like i said their personality is almost like mysterious not like necessarily mysterious but it's just like it's very different than everyone else's and it draws a lot of people in and a lot of people really want to get to know scorpio because they're very different once you get to know them and i feel like that's also a thing a lot of people like about scorpio so jealousy kind of revolves around scorpio scorpios yes they do get jealous easily but people also get jealous of scorpio too because they kind of attract people like how leos kind of attract people because they're kind of outgoing and they like make it known like they make themselves known like as they should but scorpios you kind of do it naturally your energy just kind of uh has this effect on people and it kind of makes you the main the main topic it kind of makes you the main person so you guys kind of have a lot of attention on you a lot of the time because of this reason your guys's energy kind of draws people in and i also feel like you guys have a little bit of like this um very heavy energy your guys's energy is very heavy and magnetic 
and it kind of draws people in just because your energy is so different you guys kind of have like this obsessive energy and it's a very strong energy to have in general and it kind of just radiates off you and people are very drawn into that and think that's very hot about you okay because it falls into like the deep mystery category about you scorpio okay so scorpio that's a little bit about you i'm sorry for missing your sign but i hope we're all good because i love you guys uh try to find out the rest of your natal chart to find out why you are even more hot based on your zodiac sign and i will talk to you guys so soon thank you for watching scorpio love you and bye hello sagittarius so sagittarius you are a fire sign so your fire sign friends are leo and aries so you would find a lot of your characteristic traits in them and you would have a really fun time with them because you all love to have fun so let's get started on to why Sagittarius's are attractive and hot. So first of all, Sagittarius, you are super charming, okay? You have this charm to you that everyone finds super charming. Kind of not like, it doesn't matter. You could be a girl, you could be a boy. Player energy almost. Like Sagittarius have this like player energy to them. They just know how to like flirt. They're very good at flirting with people. Sagittarius's are super carefree. They don't really care about you know breaking the rules or doing something fun they rather put like their own fun first like they are just looking for a good time everyone wants to have fun in life Sagittarius is just make it their priority people really find that attractive about you how you have this carefree spirit to you you don't really care what people think about you you know you're very outgoing people find that very attractive about you Sagittarius so Sagittarius are usually super cool and nice they're usually the cool kids and that is because of your planet is Jupiter Jupiter is the planet of luck, so you have a lot of things in life that are lucky, like how people view you and how you guys are the cool ones. You guys are lucky with the with the relationships, with the friends, just all that type of stuff. Like all fire signs, Sagittarius are very outgoing and adventurous and confident, and confidence is key, obviously, so people find that very attractive about you, Sagittarius. And then naturally, um, Sagittarius's are kind of just attractive people. So try to find out the rest of your natal chart to find out why you are even more attractive. All right. So Sagittarius, that's all I have for you. And I love you guys and goodbye. Hello Capricorn. So let's find out why you are attractive based on your zodiac sign. And so you are an earth sign along with Taurus and Virgo. So you would find a lot of your characteristic traits in them. So naturally Capricorns are super down to earth people. That's probably because they're an earth sign, but they are very down to earth okay they're super calm they're super chill and obviously a lot of people are attracted to calm and chill people and you guys are part of the chill and calm group you guys are super loyal and reliable and i mean super loyal everyone can spot your guys's loyalty a mile from away okay and that's what some people find super attractive obviously everyone wants a loyal um relationship a loyal person in a relationship obviously everyone wants a loyal friend that loyalty that you guys hold is super attractive so capricorns love the same way that they want to be loved and obviously everyone wants to be loved and most of the time capricorn you want to be loved put out that love that you want to receive so that also attracts people a lot when you put out that energy when you put out that love because most of the time you don't just give people love, you don't just go around telling people you love them and showing a lot of love. So when you do do that, it's very attractive for a lot of people. And then when Capricorns do find someone that they love, they will do anything to show them that they love them and that's super attractive to a lot of people, Capricorn. You guys go out of your way to make it known to that person that you like. You'll kind of make it known and a lot of people find that super attractive, Capricorn. Also, you guys, like sometimes people take this as like a bad characteristic trait for you guys you guys are very like cold and distant and like kind of just like keep to yourself more you know you kind of have that vibe but a lot of people do find that attractive like i was saying like with the chill and calm thing you guys are very like cold and distant so a lot of times people like see that as like an opportunity to break open you know because there's a lot of people here that like a challenge like a game you know what i mean so a lot of people find that very attractive about you is how you're cold and distant closed off and people find that very very attractive about you because it's kind of like a mysterious type of thing you know people need to crack you open people need to get to know you and then also 
everyone knows that you are not gonna waste their time so that's also why people find you really attractive because that's some quality traits people want to have in themselves is to not waste anyone's time but a lot of the times people do do that and, and it ends up wasting their own time so you do not do that and you're really good at not wasting it, your time or anyone else's time so that's also something people find attractive about you because that's something that everyone wants to have in themselves too and you guys are very good at that all right capricorn so that is why you are attractive if you want to find out the rest of your natal chart and skip down to the other zodiac signs that are in your chart to find out why you even are more attractive and i will talk to you guys so soon thank you for watching capricorn love you guys bye hello pisces all right pisces so let's find out why you are hot and attractive based on your zodiac sign so you guys are water signs along with cancer and scorpio so you would find a lot of yourself in them and you guys would really get along good with each other all right so let's find out why you are hot so Pisces, you guys are super romantic people. You just have that natural romance in you. You love the romance. You love to give the romance. You love to receive the romance. You guys are just naturally romantic people. So because Pisces are huge daydreamers and they have such big dreams for themselves, they have like very high, almost like high standards to what they are going to do in their life because they dream so high and they know that they're able to achieve everything they like to share those ideas and dreams and goals with people and it really inspires people okay so you guys inspire so many people and people find that so attractive about you guys so keep telling people your goals and your dreams and what you're capable of that is so attractive to people people love that and inspires them and makes them want to take action that is super hot and people love that you guys have very high fantasies you guys are very dreamy and people really like that type of vibe sometimes people are just attracted to dreamy people and you guys are very dreamy you know what i mean so one thing about you guys pisces is that you're so good at understanding people and connecting with people on a deeper level okay so when you are in a room and you're talking to people and you really connect and vibe with people and you really help them on a deeper level people love that people can just tell that you understand them right away you just are this very understanding person and people can see that right away and people love that with you pisces is one of the most attractive prettiest um hottest people in the world because of your guys you're just so understanding and kind and like people just love that love to see it people love to see it you're so good at reading people and people can see that you know you almost have like this like even if you're not spiritual uh you all um, like all pisces almost have like this spiritual vibe to them creative mystical vibe to them because they're so like dreamy and like understanding and people can just sense that that draws people in a lot and like people are just like naturally drawn into you because of that but you guys are super empathetic so obviously if your friend is sad you know you start to feel sad you can feel it too and you ask them what's wrong and like they know that you care so you're very caring and then you're just like you just give off such a caring vibe to everyone and people love that about you okay pisces so find the rest of your natal chart information out and go watch the rest of your video sun moon or rising whatever and find out why you are even more attractive all right pisces so i will talk to you guys so soon thank you for watching and goodbye love you hi aquarius all right aquarius let's find out why you are hot and attractive based on your zodiac sign so aquarius you guys are air signs along with gemini and libra so those are the signs that you would find most of yourself in them they are very similar to you all right so you guys are super big dreamers all right but not like dreamers like in your head you know like not super big daydreamers but you guys are huge dreamers like you have a lot of big goals for yourself you have a lot of good skills you have like a lot of things you're good at naturally and like it leads you to have big goals and big dreams for yourself that you're capable of achieving and you know like water signs like to daydream it's more of like you guys actually take actions on those daydreams and like you put in actual facts and evidence um, because you guys are very smart. You guys are one of the most smartest signs and you put a lot of actual facts and evidence into things that you can achieve. You know, you um, 
I'll get logical and realistic with it. So a lot of people find that very attractive, especially how smart you guys are. So a lot of people find that super attractive. They love smart people. So that's one super big thing that's hot about you guys. So uh, Aquariuses are just super independent people. Aquariuses love to do things on their own, you know. Uh, they love to be alone. They love to, they love people of course, but they're, you know, they're an air sign. They love to chat it up with people and have conversations and like have a good time. But Aquariuses really like to be by themselves. You know, they can handle being alone. They like to be alone because they can embrace their strangeness when they're alone. That's another thing. Aquariuses are a little bit unique and strange and that's like the main reason why people are attracted to you guys because of your uniqueness you're so different than everyone and i don't know if you guys sometimes people go out of their way that are aquariuses to make them be known that they're unique by dressing in weird things because that's how they express themselves you guys are just unique and different but sometimes people don't even some of the aquariuses don't do that but we can also see that you're a little unique like you just have a different type of mindset than everyone else. You're actually one of the most unique signs too. There's not a lot of Aquariuses in the world. That's the least common zodiac sign. And you guys are very just unique and different and quirky and fun, I feel like. You guys are very artistic people. So a lot of your goals and ambitions uh, will, like are more about like artistic -y things like drawing or singing or making clothes or whatever it is that you guys do they're just they're just kind of strange people and that is the number one thing why people are attracted to you guys because you're so strange and people love that people love that uniqueness you know you're not the same as every other person okay and then also you guys are super smart i have a lot of thoughts in your head you know you're so quick with your thinking and quick with your words you guys are very good at that and a lot of people also find that super attractive about you Aquarius, okay? So everyone loves your uniqueness. You guys also have, I feel like in my opinion, Aquariuses have a really good sense of style. You know, even if it is a little bit different, it's like still a really good sense of style. So Aquarius, that's what I have for you. So go ahead and find the rest of your natal chart and find out why you even are more attractive based on the rest of your natal chart, okay? So thank you guys so much for watching. You were the last sign, so I'm gonna end it here. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys so soon. Thank you so much and goodbye.